Hi, I'm Dr. Wayne Burkholz with Total Performance Physical Therapy. Today we're going to go over a taping technique that might be helpful for you if you have a nifropatellar bursitis. So this would be a pain that sits right below your kneecap. Um, so if your kneecap is sitting right here, the bursa under your kneecap sits right here. So if you're getting the pain right here, just below your kneecap, like kind of between your kneecap and, and your shin, that's the pain that we're talking about for this taping today. So the things that you're going to need, you're, now everything I'm going to show you is name brand. You can buy a different name brand. That's fine. So we use tough skin just as a glue to make everything stick. Cover roll as our base. And then Luco tape as the tape that actually holds everything in place. So you're going to start off with, with the, the tough skin. Just going to put the, this down where you're going to plan to put the tape. So there we go. Going to give that a little bit of time to dry. You're going to take your cover roll. You want to basically make a V with this. So the V is going to sit around the kneecap. So in this case, you're going to find the kneecap. Mark off your tape. Make two pieces the same length. You want to try and get the, the curl out of the tape just because it's going to make your life easier if the curl isn't as bad. So once you take the, the backing off, it curls up on itself. Good luck getting it unstuck. All right. So now you're going to once again feel for the kneecap. And now the tape, the glue is going to feel very sticky because now it's dry. And you're basically going to outline the kneecap with the tape. Trim that since I'm dealing with hands. Alright. Now, in the perfect situation, you're going to be dealing with the leg that's more exposed, um, in which case you would run it all up a little bit higher. Now, you're going to take your Luco tape. You're going to start this at the bottom. You're going to about one inch from the end. Start at one inch from the end of the tape that you're following. Hold that spot with your thumb, pull up, and anchor it down. We're going to do the same thing on the other side. This side's going to look a little short just because we had to cut the tape. Once again, you want it to end about an inch away from the end of the tape. All right. One other thing that I recommend, this isn't part of the traditional taping, but this triangle right here, I'm going to give you a shot of it. That's where it's going to come undone first. So you might want to take a small square of the, your cover roll. Just like that size. You put that over the, the point. Just kind of keep everything down so that as they're walking and things are rubbing on it, it doesn't come undone. That will give you another shot of that. So that's just a protection to keep the corners from coming undone. So that's the entire taping. What it does is just take some of the pressure off of that bursa right there. Um, it's a really good taping, helps with, with this issue. One thing you might want well to warn your patient about is the first couple steps are going to feel a little weird because the knee's not going to want to straighten until that, that tape loosens up a little bit.
But other than that, give it a shot. Let us know.